It's not too late to book that winter vacation or even look ahead to spring break. Choose Telluride, Colorado. That's where we are right now. And it's so easy to get to with two direct flights out of Dallas. So we have the scenery, we have the snow. I'm gonna gear up and show you around town. It's a site usually reserved for screensavers or perhaps a picture hanging over your mantle. These are the majestic mountains of Telluride, Colorado. And with over 15 feet of snow so far this year, it's truly a winter wonderland. We're nestled here in the middle of the San Juan Mountains, uh, which is the highest concentration of 13ers and 14ers, many of which you can see from the ski resort here. There's the Wilson Range right behind me here, but just a pretty dramatic view. Imagine being surrounded by these unforgettable peaks and breathtaking views all while gliding down world-renowned ski terrain. It's got just about something for everybody. You know, there's a lot of really fun intermediate beginner terrain. Uh, you know, our beginner slopes aren't just tiny. You can actually get a real good feel for skiing. And then you can also push it just about as far as you want. You know, we have some really good advanced and expert terrain and uh, just iconic views everywhere. I'm more of a take it easy, enjoy the views kind of skier. But if you want to take it up a notch or even down, those runs are just a chairlift away. We have a, a wide variety of lifts, including the gondola that accesses the town and just about every single lift that we have accesses intermediate terrain. So you can ride every lift out here and not be put into somewhere where you feel like you're in over your head. Ski a little, eat a lot. Telluride Ski Resort and Mountain Village offers plenty of delicious options. 10 restaurants, in fact, for breakfast, lunch, or simply a nice glass of wine. Surrounded by the mountains and stunning views are first stop, French cuisine, on a heated patio under a massive umbrella. This is Bon Vivant. The umbrella is uh, from Austria. It's a 20-foot umbrella. Uh, all the controls are in German. So uh, whenever we open it, we always say Schleißen to close and Ofen to open. And then uh, it's, uh, it's a pretty special place. So we're sitting up at 11,000 feet. We're at the top of chair five, uh, also called Polar Queen Lift. We do full French bistro with uh, full French wine list, uh, craft cocktails and uh, crepes made on the deck. And here's an insider tip. Try the wild mushroom soup. Oh, so delicious. Vice President of Culinary Services, Stephen Roth, suggests you plan your day around your meals. We want to change the uh, game from people who eat to ski to people who ski to eat. For us, like the perfect day in the mountain is starting here at Bon Vivant uh, for a crepe and a coffee in the morning, ski around for a while, then go to Alpino Vino for a little charcuterie and a bottle of wine in the afternoon, and then finish up listening to some great live music at Garano Ranch in the afternoon. Attention to detail, focus on quality ingredients and hospitality. The people at Telluride Ski Resort take their dining experience just as serious as their ski slopes. We're the only ski resort in North America that has an in-house hospitality training program. And what we do is uh, we have a 14 course curriculum that teaches our staff who want to continue in education and hospitality how to treat our guests and treat our guests in the right way. And I think it really shows in the service we give. It's the most important thing we do. Now all the fun may be on the slopes, but there's just as much fun off the slopes too. I'm talking to Matt Wynn, he's the Vice President of Sales and Marketing. And we are in Mountain Village right now. And uh, this is an incredible place to be because really, it's all happening right here. It is. Mountain Village is incredibly unique for others compared to other ski resorts. You know, we have hotels and restaurants and shopping all right here in this European village. Everything is in walking distance, just steps away from the slopes. And that's sort of a theme in Telluride. So when you're here, you don't need a car. You can be in the village or you can be down in the historic Main Street and everything is a gondola ride away. So no rental cars are needed. You take a shuttle from the airport. But again, the village is very European, surrounded by these 13,000 foot peaks. For the shopping scene, we have everything from a North Face store in Burton to some Telluride sports locations, ski rental locations. On the restaurant side, we have everything from mom and pop cafes to you know wonderful gourmet dining. Your trip isn't complete without a quick and scenic gondola ride from the mountain village to the historic mining town of Telluride. There, you'll find cozy Victorian homes lining the streets, cobblestone pathways that lead to a wide variety of shops, and one of the best steaks this side of the river from New Sheridan Chop House. We have people leaving here nightly that say, that's the best steak I've ever had in my life. I know you guys are from Texas and you have some good steaks as well, but here in Telluride, Colorado, we pride ourselves in our steaks here in the New Sheridan Chop House. Telluride has it all. For those getting away with the kits, 
for a romantic vacation or even a girl's trip. It's a destination that is unforgettable. Come here and let us do the rest, you know? Leave the keys of the car inside the hotel or the condo and just come up here and have fun. So as the sun says goodnight behind the mountains of Telluride and the village now glows with light, the slopes are cut and groomed into another fresh layer of powder, setting the scene for another day at the Telluride Ski Resort.